Here we go, guys. Thanks again for the fill. We're doing one box of National Treasures, uh, box number 122. Those are your uh, those are your teams. Yeah, I think I put, I've been putting $200 for everybody because uh, that way it goes through. Otherwise, it, it will get stuck. Uh, all right. There are your teams. I am Soccer Breakers FC, or at least I should say there's a chance it may get stuck if you declare under that. I am Soccer Breakers FC. If you're interested in joining my breaks, join our Facebook group, Soccer Breakers FC. All breaks are live on YouTube. Check us out on our website, www.soccerbreakersfc.com. Follow us on Instagram, Soccer Breakers. All right, here we go, guys. Uh, oh, yeah, if you're watching on YouTube, guys, please be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel if you have not done so yet. Thanks, guys, for all the likes. 45 of you really appreciate that. Thank you. A slow night tonight, but hey. Anyway, just let me know what you want me to put. I know last time you bought, I don't know if you got your boxes from, I shipped, uh, when was it? Earlier this week or last? It was last week, I think. That big box that, I think you had a big box, right? That had a bunch of boxes in it. How much did they charge you for that on customs? I got them yesterday. Cripsy, what's up, brother? How about the little gold Blaszczykowski for Poland? The one of ten. Old Blaszczykowski. 55 pounds. And what was the amount? Wasn't the amount like $200? I don't understand that. It's supposed to be 20%. So how is 20% of $200 55 pounds? I, I don't get that. Yeah. I'll put whatever amount you want me to put, Sam. Just let me know as long as I, I was just told it may get stuck, but who knows? Maybe they're going through. Yeah, so 20% of $200 is $40, and $40 converted to pounds should be about 30 pounds. I don't know how they went from 30 pounds to 55 pounds. I don't know, you may want to ask them, how did they come up with 55 pounds on $200? I'd be really curious to know. What's up, then, Bella? Because I've heard all different versions. I mean, some people are getting charged 30 pounds, some people are getting charged 60 pounds on the same exact amount. So, I don't know, I guess it's just the whim of the customs guy. Should be the same amount because every box I send almost is that same $200. Uh, Belgium. Russell Riley again. I think the last that one's you too. Uh, for Treasure Hunt. Well, this was UPS, but yeah, probably UPS does the same, right? Greg, do you know since you work for, are they enforcing? Because I was told that if you send it for under 135 pounds right now, uh, you're supposed to have that number, and I don't. So, like, when I go to fill it out, a, like, little red thing comes up and says, if you don't have a VAT number, packages could get returned. Over 135 pounds, you don't need it, because you guys collect it when it arrives. Uh, Graziano Pelle, Italy. Ryan Di Benedetto, but then I was told that there a lot of them aren't enforcing it because there's such a backlog on applications for VAT numbers by international sellers. So it's just, I don't know, but that's what stamps.com that I ship with, like sent me a whole big thing warning that if you ship under 135 pounds, you're doing it at your own risk. And uh, 
thing that worried me is it said packages may get held up in customs, returned, or destroyed. I was like, destroyed? I was like, no, no, don't be destroying my packages. But again, some people like that buy cheaper brakes, they've been having me just put like $10 value and ship in the regular bubble mailers and for the most part, they're all getting through. England, David Nunn. David Nunn. Yeah, I guess so. England, David Nunn. Anas Rodriguez. Colombia, William Thais. I don't know, maybe we're just worried for nothing. I honestly, I don't know. Sometimes I wonder if all that, you know, because they made like this huge stink about it. And now I'm thinking maybe it was just to scare everybody. Anyway, Sam, we can try it. I'll, I'll try sending it, declaring a small amount, and we can see what happens. William Thais. Twenty-nine of thirty-five. Bailey Flint. Netherlands. Renee. Thibaut Courtois, one of ten, jersey number, boom shakalaka. One of ten, Thibaut Courtois, that's going to go to Russ Riley. Uh, I know, uh, Luke Curtis, he buys for me, uh, a lot of boxes, um, he's a good guy, I think it's UK Box Breaks or Box Breaks UK, not one of those two, he's a good guy, David Luis, uh, to 25, I mean, obviously, Jack from, I mean, Jack doesn't really break a lot, but he does break a little bit. High face, not really, I guess, a breaker yet, but he does do some breaks every now and then. 19 of 25, David Luis. But, yeah, Luke Curtis, is, he's 
Who was that? Uh, Brazil, Min Kim. Also, uh, in Germany, um, Thorsten, our resident Eintracht Frankfurt fan. I forget what his is called. In, in the bot, what's Thorsten's site called? Do you guys know? David Duish, uh, Brazil, Min Kim. Forget the names, but. Yeah, no, UK box breaks uh, does them regularly. I, I think it's UK. You look up UK box breaks or either UK box breaks or box breaks UK, one of the two. He's got a website and he does uh, he does single box breaks mostly. Mark Overmars to ten. Netherlands. Netherlands belongs to Renee. And one last card left. Oh, darn it. I thought I wrote the card. That's all I got left is rookie card max. I just went the wrong. Boom shakalaka for the USA. How about a little Landon Donovan, Christian Pulisic, dual autograph, 27 of 35. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed as the sunrise last gleaming whose broad stripes and broad stars through the perilous one. All right, boom shakalaka, USA. Congratulations. Dan's been doing well with the US. Dan consistently grabs them and he's been hitting some nice stuff. You're welcome, Renee. That is going to be Mr. Dan Norton. Hello, Dan. Congrats. Let me pull that same card for you in one of the last cases. I can't remember if it's I'm gonna do some personals after this. So we'll just grab them and do them quickly and then we'll do a breakaway after that. So. Alright, recap. William, you got Thomas Rodriguez patch to 35. Ryan Di Benedetto, Graziano Pelle patch to 99. 
David Nunn. You got uh, John Stones to 99. Oh, David Bowie, you are the love of my life, or Min Kim, number 19 to 25. Then we got for the Netherlands, for Rene, we had a Daily Blint patch and a Mark Overmark 8 of 10 on card autograph. And then Russ, uh, we had three cards. We had Wachowski to 10, uh, Musa Dembele. Patch to 99 and 1 of 10 jersey number Thibaut Courtois autograph. But the big wiener was Dan. Daniel Morton. Congrats, Dan. Here you go, brother. Uh, 27 of 35. Landon Donovan, Christian Pulisic. US and Dave. All right, so end that one.